hey this is just a vlog i don't really know what this video is but basically i'm going into town like getting some room decorations just getting some bits and so you guys are kind of spending the day with me i don't really know what it's gonna be like but got some new sunglasses kind of cute um yeah it's actually really hot today it's a really rare occasion for the uk but i'm not complaining i'm still wearing a jumper and jeans though we can't risk it basically but i'll probably take my jumper off anyway I was literally, how long was I out for? I was out for like one and a half hours. The shopping trip itself was a huge success. It looks like I'm a bit naked, but it was a big success. And a girl bossed my way through. I didn't get too stressed out. It was actually a really good trip out because usually I stress and I like start to cry. So let me give you a hoo. Firstly from H&M, I got this pink halter neck. I have one in white and I wanted one in like a different colour as well and because my my colour palette for the summer is pink, green and blue so I was like this is going to go perfect and it's going to match a lot of things. So this was 3 99 and the lady at the till asked if I wanted a bag and I was like no thanks and she gave me a bag and you know, made me pay for it but I was like too awkward to say I don't want one so getting okay, ripped off. I then went to Body Care, which was like this little like skincare place in my town, which is like really, really cheap. It's like scarily cheap. But I got like these like tea tree nose pore strips and I also got like these gold ones to go with my little collection. And they were like really cheap. They were like 99p each. I then went to the works and originally I wanted a vision board, which I got. I know I had to walk around the shops with this. I love it, this was £4 uh, from the works and I think it was a bargain, I do need to print off pictures though, which I did forget to do. And they're also from the works, because I was like looking around in Waterstones and I was like, I think I need a new book. Like I have like, I've got, I've saved up a little bit of money, maybe I'll like treat myself on a book. And I ended up really going out and I bought two books and I know I'm really behind. So I got the Love, oh god this is going to be embarrassing. Hypothesis. So I got the love hypothesis. I'm actually good at English. You won't believe it. I mean, I'm actually pretty good at English. Okay. Did a five, five pounds. I'm sorry, but they were selling them for like nine pounds in Waterstones. I was like, I know where to get them cheaper. The works. Trust me. Our little secret. And yes, I'm hopping on the trend. I've wanted to read this for so long. You have not you have no idea how long I've wanted been wanting to read this. But I just like never got around to it. And I'd always spend my money on like really stupid things. So I was like, you know what? And this was also five pounds. I got um it ends of us. And also because it's like it starts with us, it's coming out soon. And I was like really excited. And I was like, wait, I haven't even read the book. But yeah, apparently these two are good reads, and so I'm really excited to read them. We're not stopping there. Oh. From Superdrug, I got um, a um, I got a foundation, and it was the Revolution Conceal and Define. The I don't see. I never know where to get my foundation from because, like, I don't really buy makeup, and I like to be on a budget when I'm buying makeup. Like, I need something good, but then like cheap. And the concealer is the best concealer I've ever had in my life. Um, and so I got the foundation for it. I got an F5, hopefully it'll be okay. Fingers crossed, if it's not, I'm gonna be devastated. And it was like 10 pounds, and <laughs> I have more. Desk POV, but this is a new POV, because I'm in my new room.
Hey guys, just a heads up that these videos at the moment are being pre-recorded and are edited and filmed in advance. So if they're not as long as they should be or like aren't up to standard, then I'm sorry, but I really hope you enjoyed it anyway.